Hello and welcome to my channel. I hope you enjoy this story. I'm going to try and upload a new story each day. The Curse Cryptographs Holly, a brilliant code breaker known for her expertise in deciphering ancient scripts, received an intriguing invitation from a mysterious collector on the Isle of Wight. The collector claimed to possess an artifact with an ancient script that had baffled scholars for centuries. Intrigued by the challenge, Holly set off to the small, fog-shrouded island, unaware of the malevolent forces lurking within the cryptic engravings. Upon arriving at the collector's secluded mansion, Holly was escorted to a dimly lit room where an ornate box awaited her. The artifact, rumored to be cursed, emanated an otherworldly aura that sent shivers down Holly's spine. Undeterred, she opened the box and revealed an ancient tablet covered in cryptic symbols. As Holly delved into the intricate script, her surroundings seemed to grow colder, and shadows danced along the edges of the room. Unbeknownst to her, the act of deciphering the code triggered a long-forgotten incantation that bound malevolent spirits to the artifact. The spirits, angry and vengeful after centuries of imprisonment, manifested in the dark corners of the room. Driven by an insatiable curiosity, Holly continued her work, decoding the script bit by bit. As each symbol fell into place, the malevolent spirits gained strength, their ghostly forms swelling around her. Unnerved but determined, Holly pressed on, unaware of the increasing danger. With the final symbol deciphered, the room plunged into darkness, and the spirits materialized into ghastly figures. The air became thick with an ominous presence, and the temperature dropped to bone-chilling levels. Panicking, Holly realized that the code she had unraveled wasn't just a puzzle, it was a key that unleashed an ancient evil. Desperate to rectify her mistake, Holly discovered a hidden compartment in the artifact. Inside, she found an additional cryptic message, a final puzzle that held the key to banishing the malevolent entities. Time was of the essence as the spirits closed in on her, whispering chilling threats that echoed through the mansion. Armed with newfound determination, Holly worked tirelessly to decipher the last cryptograph. The message revealed an incantation that, if spoken correctly, would bind the spirits once again. However, the spirits, aware of her efforts, intensified their attacks. Shadows clawed at her, and ghostly hands reached out to grasp her in a cold, ethereal grip. As Holly neared the completion of the incantation, the room trembled with the unleashed fury of the spirits. The temperature plummeted, and the mansion echoed with tormented wails. With beads of sweat on her forehead, Holly uttered the final words, and a blinding light engulfed the room. When the light subsided, Holly found herself alone in the now silent chamber. The malevolent spirits were banished, and the artifact lay dormant. Exhausted and shaken, Holly realized the consequences of her intellectual pursuit. The cryptic script wasn't just a puzzle, it was a warning, a safeguard against the release of ancient malevolence. Leaving the Isle of Wight, Holly vowed never to underestimate the power of ancient symbols. The cursed cryptographs had tested her intellect, but they had also taught her the importance of respecting the boundaries between the living and the supernatural. As she sailed away from the fog-shrouded island, Holly couldn't shake the feeling that the spirits she had banished were watching waiting for another curious soul to unlock their cryptic prison. Weeks passed since Holly's harrowing encounter on the Isle of Wight, but the memories of the malevolent spirits and the cursed cryptographs lingered in her dreams. Despite her best efforts to move on, an unsettling curiosity gnawed at her, urging her to understand the origin and purpose of the artifact. One night, as she perused her vast collection of ancient texts and manuscripts in her study, Holly stumbled upon a forgotten tome. Its pages contained references to a secret society that had once safeguarded forbidden knowledge, sealing away dark forces through cryptic rituals. The Isle of Wight was mentioned as a location where the society had hidden their most dangerous artifacts. Driven by a newfound sense of responsibility, Holly realized that the curse was not isolated to the single artifact she had encountered. There were likely more cryptographs scattered across the island, each containing its own malevolent secret. Determined to prevent others from unwittingly releasing these forces, she decided to return to the Isle of Wight and uncover the truth. Upon her return, Holly embarked on a perilous journey through the island's mistreated landscapes guided only by the ancient texts and her own intuition.
she discovered hidden caves, forgotten ruins, and cryptic symbols etched into the very fabric of the isle. As she deciphered each cryptograph, she encountered echoes of the malevolent spirits trapped in spectral remnants of their former existence. With each banishment, the island seemed to sigh with relief, but Holly knew her quest was not over. The final cryptograph led her to a desolate cemetery where an imposing mausoleum stood. Inside, she uncovered a chamber adorned with arcane symbols and guarded by an otherworldly force. The final cryptograph, more intricate and ominous than the others, revealed a dire truth. The curse was an ancient pact, a balance between the malevolent forces and the secret society. As she unraveled the code, Holly learned that the society had vanished, leaving behind the cryptographs as a safeguard against the forces they once controlled. To break the curse completely, Holly faced a choice, sacrifice her own well-being to become the guardian of the cryptographs or let the malevolent forces roam free, unrestrained by the ancient pact. Torn between duty and self-preservation, she hesitated, feeling the weight of the decision pressing upon her. In a moment of clarity, Holly understood the true nature of the curse. It was a test, not just of intellect, but of character. With a resolute spirit, she recited the incantation from the final cryptograph, willingly becoming the new guardian. The mausoleum trembled as the curse lifted, and the malevolent spirits faded away. Holly emerged from the mausoleum, changed but victorious. The Isle of Wight, once a haven for dark forces, was now free from their influence. As she sailed away from the misty shores, Holly knew that her journey had not only been a quest for knowledge but a testament to the strength of the human spirit in the face of ancient malevolence. The cursed cryptographs were silenced, and the secrets of the Isle of Wight remained hidden once more, safeguarded by Holly's sacrifice. Thank you for listening, I hope you enjoyed this story. Please don't forget to like and even better like and subscribe. Thank you very much and I hope you have had or have a great day.